we're gonna go armenians against fire and we're gonna try to pick up some relics um so just for those who don't know uh i'm gonna tell you guys in the chat then when the new viewers come asking what's the challenge and they can't read the chat right there tell them in the chat what's happening so only spears and monks until we get five relics then we must win with anything available so once we get five relics or more we can win anything is available we're gonna pick sip for this one just to make it a little bit easier on me you guys know i usually like to go random sip but for this one i think it's a pretty hard challenge we're gonna run armenians here get access to warrior priest that's gonna be nice to collect the relics we're gonna get access to uh spears in dark age which could be really nice remember i can't build militia only spearmen so we're gonna try this out man try this out see how we can uh see how we can do all right and he's up with the Britons. Oh, that could be kind of bad. I was hoping he'd get a Knight Civ so I can get away with uh <laughs> so I can get away with my spears. Um I think we're gonna have to go for a spearman rush, to be honest. I think that makes sense. Um I think is if he has archers, I need to somehow go warrior piece with like armor. I cannot make siege, so I have to like sneak the relics in. And then once I get the relics, then I can go siege. Not that Siege is that great for Spritons anyways, to, to be fair. Alright. Alright, hello Starfire Shepardo. Can I make Siege? No, I cannot. Uh, what's funny is that it's April Fool's today, but uh, I, I was thinking of making a video, but I just honestly could not be bothered. Like, I feel like at this point it's like, it, it's so been overdone <laughs> that uh, it's just, uh, I, I didn't think it was even worth it to commit to one. How to stop him in Feudal? I basically cannot, like... Um, I, I don't really see a way where I can deal with archers and feudal. So my plan is going to be to fast castle uh, after doing a drush with spearmen in Dark Age. And that's going to be like the main strat, the main approach. Um, all right, would you like that? Warrior priest is considered a monk. Yeah. Hello, Haven. How's it going, man? How am I? I'm doing great, man. What about you? Actually, I was. Just before starting the stream, I, like I knew I was going to stream today. Today is Monday, right? And I had a, a I have a tournament at 11 a.m. today. Um, I was actually thinking, you know what? Do I be lazy and do I come on at around 11 and go straight in the tournament? But honestly, I'm glad I hopped on earlier because now we got this challenge to do. And I want to play a few off meta Monday games before jumping into a tournament. I want to get a good old like long stream in for you guys today. I feel like I've been scamming on the weekend. Very short streams, you know? Let's get the long Monday streams then again. Alright. Uh, forward gold, which feels really bad. Remember, I, I could use tower defense. So I might actually just mine stone instead of gold. And chat it up with towers. Because I'm going to need a tower to defend my wood line most likely. I don't really see another way to do it. Nextville can make a house, then barracks. Then I can set up my spears early, like a primo drush. And I'm not sure if the strat will work, but if you guys like the strategy, it's actually part of my strategy guide for my Twitch subscribers and Patreon members. Um, so if you guys are interested in that, definitely look into it. It's basically, like I said, the Spears and Dark Age into Fast Castle Relic Control with Armenians. I think it's not the best way to play Armenians. Don't get me wrong. It's not like it's like revolutionary, but it's a very unique style. And if you practice it and you're good at it, your opponent will not really know what you're going to do. And I like that. I think that's cool. It's like an anti, or like not really anti-meta, but it's like an off-meta strat that actually feels pretty good. And Armenians as a Civ are pretty strong right now, so I think it's worth uh, checking out at least. Well, Ar Armenians are pretty strong, but they're awkward. They have a uh, an awkward late game, so and that's why I like to take the six relics with them. In this case, I need at least five. Just to make that late game a little bit smoother. All right, so now we go for the Dark Age Spearmen. And obviously, I don't have to explain it even, but uh, Spearmen are way better than Militia. Like, it's not even close. Militia costs gold, which is, you know, pretty awkward in early game. And uh, they're also pretty slow. Spearmen, number one, they destroy scouts, right? So if I run into a scout, they just absolutely decimate him. Um, and number two, they're really fast. They outrun villages easily. And so drushing with Spearmen is much better than drushing with uh, Militia, in my opinion. You, the only thing you're missing is obviously the one damage. Spearmen have one less damage than Militia. But other than that, man, it's really good. Uh, okay, sorry. Some first game of the day clicks there. 
Uh, I only like to do two militia, uh, two spearmen, sorry. I feel like two is all you need. If you go for three man, it feels good because you get to block, but it just delays your mill and I don't know. It just leaves you kind of kind of out on your own. Uh, I think he's doing the build where he goes mill uh, after feudals. He goes mining camp here. He goes for the barracks. Did you see my militia, man? Uh, my spears, sorry, on militia. He definitely sees them now. And it looks like he is going to go for the fast archer rush. So we're going to have to, like, defend with... Dude, I don't even know. Probably... Yeah, we probably have to defend with towers as the only option. I don't really see another option here. Yeah, he's going uh, mill later, so mining camp now. We'll still commit to our strat. There's not much we can do. We can only make spears at the end of the day, so... You know, part of the challenge here. But I, I could wall up the base a bit. That could be pretty good. Dude, everything is walled in. <laughs> I can't hit anything. Uh, also, another cool thing is that once you get to Feudal Age, you can't really clear my militia with his... Uh, sorry, I can't clear my spheres with the scout like you can my militia, usually. So, it, you know, it has that other added benefit. What I'm going to do, because I clearly can't fight the archers, what I'm going to do is instead, going to camp his berries to hurt his build production. So I haven't done too much with them, which is natural. We're not going to go to gold either. Like, cannot afford that, obviously. Gotta just wall up. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, we'll lose the bill for sure. Alright. We can't FC, That's, which is really problematic because I'm going to go straight onto stone and right, see if I can harass him. But now you can see he's a bit desperate here to get onto some of that, uh, some of that berry. It is hard to harass that at the end of the day, I only have three spears. Two spears, two spears, one scout. Yeah, I, I really like the spearmen. They're they're way better than militia for many reasons. This is hard. It's going to be difficult to defend that. I'm bothering him as much as I can. Gonna make a spear, and I think I want to show him the range, but I don't know. Then again, I can't really use it, right? So it's like if I show him the range, it's really good. Because it kind of like fakes the fact that I'm gonna go skirms. But then again, I can't use the range, so I'm just wasting it. Which I'm conflicted about here. We need market for sure, since I don't have gold access, that's a no-brainer. I'm gonna go for a tower here. I could always leave, but I want a tower that would land. I don't want to have to abandon it. Abandoning it is really expensive. Alright, well, my militia didn't do a whole lot. Listen, I'd be lying if I said it was a successful. Drush, but I also don't think they did that bad either. Bought me a lot of time. That range is like kind of defending this area a little bit. All right, let's, the spearman can run now. I'm just gonna run my scout back shot to snipe his scout. Feels like the best thing I can do right, right now. Probably wall this side, with like the blacksmith. Problem is, if he gets in here, he's gonna actually um hit my farms a lot.
I don't know if I can care about that though. Oh god. Yeah, I don't know if I can care about this. Might have to just let him get in. No access to golds. Pretty sad. This would be so easy to defend if I just had a, a range. So, like, the actual build order, you're supposed to go range at this point, like, and get a few skirms to clear him out, and then fast castle, which would be super easy. Like, I don't think what he's doing here is necessarily, like, all that strong. It's not bad. He's not, like, misplaying or anything. It's just that it's regular archers, you know? I'm just dying to, like, the standard play, because I'm obviously mid-challenge. But I'm hoping once I get, like, some warrior priests out, maybe... Um... I have to get armor on them. That guy's gonna die. Nothing much you can do about this. Maybe I'll go scout him. See if he's got a, a stable or anything like that. Stable could be a nice counter to what I'm doing. Light cav or strong. We'll go church. Probably here or something. Just to force him off. I could castle drop. Not sure what that helps for though. Yeah, we're gonna do this. Get it down. Not sure if I'm gonna add a TC. Feels like a bit too much. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna add a town center. I think I want more farms if anything. So I got one relic right off the bat. We're gonna obviously want squires. And let's try to get to gold here, man. Gold is so needed. I'm going like pure monk. Or maybe instead of trying to fight his army, I just go straight to the relics. Because at the end of the day, if I get the five relics, I can do whatever I want. It's part of the challenge, right? Also, I'm so stupid. I, I should have used my scout to find the relics. What am I? I'm brain dead. I am brain dead, boys. That's the one wolf I brought there myself. God. He's already cast. I don't think... I, how can I hold crossbows? The answer is I have to tower this for sure. He's going to see that one as well. I'm going to have to tower this as well. Just doing random tower defense, which isn't great. He has crossbows here. It's a disaster. Oh, the warrior priest is going in though. Yo, they're not even bad. Bought myself some time. <laughs> Dude, that was not even bad. <laughs> and in this area, I got access to my gold. Let's go ahead and pick this up. Have this uh, tower here to defend me as well. I'm going to obviously need to get fletching here though. He breaks on the back. That could be problematic. But then again. I hate that the mule cart can garrison by the way. Dude, they should just remove that. Why would you ever need a garrison a mule cart? Uh, he picked me up there. Yeah, this, this is annoying now. I don't want to fall too far behind. Military either. I think of forward castles. 
a good idea. We gotta get here. More relics. I need one more. Fifth relic. I don't need to make this, just take this. I gotta get some ranges or something here. Try to go elite skirm. I got five relics. Nice. Now we can make all kinds of units. Question is, is it too late? I have enough for a castle, but I just can't walk forward for the castle. There's a lot of stone in the center. Definitely went in on that. Uh, this warrior piece are a bit worthless. Uh. Oh, those guys are hella annoying. I gotta get there with my warrior piece. Skirmish down the front. I, I wanna get a castle on the hill. Right, right there, it's so important. He knows it as well, though. He's got ballistics. I dodge ballistics here. Maybe I lure him in? Nah. Dude, warrior priests are absolutely worthless. You know what the problem with them? They're just, they move too slow. Like these guys are with squires. They're so slow. It's like it's just not ignite. They're really it's not really a it's a, not a fighting unit. Like I used to think when this first was released, I was like a fighting unit. It's not. It's a support unit that heals. That's it. It can fight a little bit in melee combat, but that's about it. Not really getting much more out of it than that. Now let's go for the Middle castle. If I get a castle on the sale, I think the game is winnable though. Late game is going to be pretty hard. Alright, we have uh, ballistics, which is nice. 
right? I should get to imp actually. Might just turn into a treb war. None of us have bomber cannons. Oh, yeah, we won the fight there. That's actually kind of nice, <laughs> kind of massive. Get a little double shot right there. Dude, can we win this? He's kind of choking a little bit in terms of like what army to go for. I'm not sure he kind of realizes what he needs to do. I'm not even sure what he should do, but he's kind of mixing it up. He's going skirms. I hope he just stays confused for a while. For us, I think it's just going to be skirm treb and hope to win the treb war basically. Uh, I would love to take that stone. And the warrior priest Adam. Clutch warrior priest. We took the relics, eh? It's not too bad. Also, God bless the Armenian relics. We only needed to get four from the map. I think it was clutch. Hit him, hit him. Oh, good deny. Let's go. Warrior priest goes in crazy. Should I put more pressure with those guys? My economy should be way weaker than his, but I do have the relics. So I'm thinking if I can get the hill with like two castles, maybe I can win. I need a faster imp though, which I'm not sure if I'm going to get. Killing Vils here is crucial. Those are potential repairers that are just going to die. Alright. Just take that hill back here. Please give me the faster rainbow, please. In the treb war, five relics is crazy good, by the way. Oh, it's close. It, it should be winnable, but maybe. Depends how good his economy is. If he's able to get werewolf treb, no way I can win. But if he can't afford that, then maybe. Castle's a bit late as well. Dude, masonry would go crazy here. Wish I had it a bit earlier though. Instead of making a few scrims on the way up, just get masonry. I was sleeping on it, what can I say? Right. Missing this mule card over here just so I can start funneling those to that zone. Uh, let's take this castle first. It's downhill. That, that was a terrible castle from him, by the way. What? You're crazy. Your warrior priest can go in. Gonna lose one castle for sure. No chance. Oh, I wonder if he has war with Freb. If he does, it's a wrap. Doesn't look like he does. Nah, he doesn't have it, I don't think. Oh, I didn't even realize I was here. Dude, that, that raid he did is so good, by the way.
crazy how he's literally just werewolf away from winning this game for sure. That he just can't get it. Oh, winning the trips. The longer this goes, the better it is for me, by the way. This trip war. I got the relics, so I really want to keep that going while setting up my economy. I also have the hill, which is so, so crazy. Missing upgrades, missing chemistry. I'm in the treb war, though. I think we might have this. Yo, please. I never needed to hit more shots. Please. Hit him! Who's shooting? Oh, let's go, Legolas. That's what I'm. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I have no rest. I have no economy whatsoever, bro. This is a disaster. Absolute. Look at the nightmare on the on the gold there. Give me the score lead. I deserve it. Give me the score lead. Got to start packing up some skirms here. This army got so much value from him, by the way. If there's one good thing he did this game, like the best play he's done, he's done a few good plays. But that one, by far, it was so good. I was doubting it at first, the raid, but it was so good. Oh, that's a great castle. If I can get that one down. Trolling here. I'm trolling. All right. I really want to clear this up, finally. is i think he still has a really good economy what we have to do is get into if, if he gets world traps I, I don't think i can win still the win condition for him that that castle is beautiful for me Let's just get some random attack rounds in there maybe i can hit those traps oh that was so close that one Oh, I'm hitting, I'm hitting, I'm hitting. Nice. Oh my god. Let's go. I don't even have the score lead, but we still got the win. Oh my god, let's go. That's a 50 sub challenge here on Off Meta Monday. Super sick game. That was a ton of fun. I didn't think we we're going to actually make that work, man. At some point, I was just hoping that the hill and the trap fight would go our way. Because that's all we could do. And, uh, dude, the counterattack hit me right where it hurt. Hit me on the gold on the wood. I lost, like, 10, 15 bills to that, and I got pushed off this gold. Luckily, I said in my main gold, so I didn't touch that all game. Dude, that was a sick, sick game. Trevor was one. Again, if he got Warwolf, I would be toast. There's no way I can beat Warwolf, because obviously I don't get Bomber Cannons. I can't I can't afford Champion. Like, I'm so far from Champion. Uh, Warrior Priest kind of carried. I'm not going to lie. Um, Stone Draw, thank you for the 50 gifted subs. If you're watching this on YouTube, that is a big donation from Stonejaw right there. So big shout out to him. Show him some love in the YouTube comments as well. This is a great game, so it's probably going to make it to YouTube. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you guys did enjoy it. And uh, we do these challenge games pretty often on Off Meta Monday as well. And if it's not a challenge, we're doing some like wacky strats, you know, just general wackiness. So if you guys like the unique gameplay, the Off Meta stuff, definitely come on down to Twitch on Mondays and catch us doing this for basically the whole day. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.